Alrighty guys, hey we are back for another shootout and this is going to be another crosswind, a little bit different. So one of the things that I just want to mention to you guys is in terms of wind correction, I like to go an additional 30%. So here I'm going to play the wind at about 12 miles per hour, which would equate to at max distance for Guardian 10 rings. So here you are going to see me go right around 10 rings. Use about 4 backspin on this hole is what I like to use. And there you have it. Um, you know, I try to simplify this hole for you guys uh, to make it uh, not too challenging. Just keep it pretty straight up and just do an overcorrection method. And as you can see, that's relatively spot on. It looks like I was able to get it here. And I didn't get to see it drop in, but it did go in. So, as you can see, you know, I just ever so slightly before making my adjustment, I did uh, point it to the left because I knew it was going to swing in pretty hard there. So I just wanted to give it just a little bit of extra guidance. And as you can see, you know, about four backspins is kind of the sweet spot to kind of hit that now. The only way that's going to change is if you start getting wind into the face. So there's times I play two backspin, there's times I play three, and of course there's times that I switch up to drivers. So I'm trying to draw out a headwind here so I can show you some of those shots, um, but I'm having a lot of difficulties give, getting this hole. So I'm going to keep do my best to keep getting this one and uh, be on the lookout for more shootouts from me. And good luck with this, and uh, I think you'll... Using my method, I think it'll be kind of spot on. Like I said, I use the max club number for my adjustments for this hole. So there you're seeing me, uh, you know, play about 12 miles per hour of wind, which is about 30% extra. In addition to that, um, on top of that, you know, I just pointed it out to the left because I knew I wanted it to come into the left of the hole there and just kind of swing at the hole. And, uh, you know, play that max distance number, which whatever, whatever your accuracy is, play accordingly. So if uh, your accuracy is 90, play 1.2. If your accuracy is 80, play 1.4 um, per ring. And you should have really good success. So good luck and keep your eyes peeled for uh, my other shootouts. So good luck.